Hi sis, welcome to Fab Chic Matters. How are you doing? My name is Doris and here we talk everything fashion. How to look chic, fabulous, sophisticated, edgy, feminine on a budget while being modest at the same time. So if this is right up your alley, I hope that you consider joining this family. And if this is not your first time watching my videos and you are a returning viewer, watcher, subscriber, I appreciate you so much. Thank you for the support. So how are you doing today sis? Today we're going to explore more of my um, closet. I've been kind of purging and actually I have purged, I have purged, I have purged. I, I choose to believe that I have purged some things. So today um, we have done before like this whole rack. If you remember up until like all of my black dresses and whatnot and I can definitely see the changes because there's like space now and this is awesome so now we're going to tackle this rack of dresses and caftans and kimonos and whatnot and uh, it helps me to rediscover my own wardrobe like things I haven't seen or worn in a while and while rediscovering my wardrobe for example revisiting the looks as well because one thing we're going to do around here we're going to show you tips on how to style those dresses and those items and any pieces that i'm showing you if i have styled it before of course i'll insert like a clip uh, a picture something so you can kind of have a visual how he looks on me and also that will inspire you for your own styling as well so i hope that we can get through here and then we can i think the dresses end over here and then this is all about tops like blouses long blouses and body suits and whatnot which will be for another day um but then yes i hope we at least get to here and you know go through the bulk of my um longer dresses and caftans and stuff like that so without further ado let's get going <laughs> i completely forgot about outfit of the day before somebody asked me and i forgot to mention it so this is actually like a cute printed like very 60s baby doll dress i just love it i thrifted it of course and uh, it's just beautiful i love the billowy sleeves i mean the, it's very light and easy breezy look at that oh, i love that dress um it's like a midi dress it comes down um it goes past my knees and i just love it i love how billowy it is it's voluminous i love the print kind of like the aztec prints tribal i love that and i bought it probably for not more than five dollars i'm pretty sure and the good thing about a dress like this sis you can always belt it you can create different shapes with it and you can wear it on its own summer is coming soon we're already in the spring you can wear like leggings underneath it you can wear it by itself with some ballet flats some espadrilles wedges with um, some sneakers some jeans underneath it you can add like something else over it you know if it's cooler i just love it then i am wearing a pair of satin zara pink pants and i love it it's very like flowy and that's also another twist on how you can style your pants for example so you can wear them underneath dresses yes and i just love it and then what else what else this is uh zara on on the website right now and this is i don't know thrifted probably so yeah this is all i'm doing very simple casual today and maybe if you are asking yourself like what area of the closet so it used to be like the um, bag tray over here like that's how i call it like you know the things to use the contraption you used to uh, hang from um, the bags or the hat and stuff like that so i had to push it all the way back so that's why you see it all open like that i'm loving this space for real okay let's get going now be too much rambling <laughs> over here this dress this dress this is gorgeous sis. i actually bought it off of shein years ago maybe seven years ago and this dress is just so beautiful this chocolate this brown chocolate color just sold me on it and the thing i love about it is that because i'm a very lazy 
ironer, <laughs> you know, like iron clothes. I had to steam it or I throw it in the dryer for a few minutes. This dress is so easy, like to remove the wrinkles and it's just perfect for me. And this is perfect with like a caftan and a baya, a kimono. If you want a more like billowy look, like when you're walking, you hear the swoosh, swoosh following you, which I love. I love wearing that over anything as well. You can wear it by itself. I have done so um, in this. I have done so in this channel, I believe. So the thing also is so good with those plain dresses like this is. This is like a blank canvas. You can play and be creative with those dresses. You can add like a stack of necklaces, like jewelry. You can add like a um, like a vest over it. You can wear a blazer over it. You can wear a coat over it. Denim jacket, denim vest. I love it. So I'm so glad I got it. I'm definitely keeping it. This is size L. And I love how loose it is. And this shape is so flattering, sis. It just, you know, kind of flares out at the bottom. And oh, I love this dress. Yes. Beautiful. Next up, we have this long caftan, which I love. This is typically like an African um caftan dress which a lot of times like men wear back home like if you are from west africa you know what i'm talking about um and i thrifted it as well look at the embroidery this is so fabulous i was like what yes and it's brown dark brown me and brown this is my favorite color so <laughs> I can help it but I love it because also we add some starch to the fabric so it's a bit like it's a bit stiff but not too much it depends on how much starch you add so you see how it kind of looks very structured and I love this so much I have actually thrifted a lot of them um, over time and I'm like thank you uncle thank you auntie whoever it is you'll be amazed so much Ankara you'll find at the thrift store um, and then you know of course any type of like cultural um, garb and um, garments I love it I snatch all of it so this is beautiful yes I'm keeping this love this what do we have here Oh, we have this dress that I actually, did I thrift it? I think I thrifted it. This was by um, Target um, with, in collaboration with Rick. So if you kind of staying abreast of those Target collaborations, you kind of remember this dress that was a few years back. And uh, yes, sometimes their collections go completely out of stock so fast within the next i don't know 30 minutes they're done so i am glad when i saw this at the three so i was like yes because i couldn't um get any of those dresses and i love this style actually i can tell of course it's going to still fit me it is the spring now and summer is around the corner which you know in florida it's always summer pretty much um so I'm definitely going to wear it. I love the floral print, as you can see, and I love the um, print mixing here at the waist as well. And of course, the elastic um, neckline, and then also at the uh, at the sleeves. So, oh, also the bottom one has that other print, that black and white print, which is very cool. This is very like Esmeralda, very flirty and feminine, which I love. And me and florals and bright and bold prints like this, we're best friends. So <laughs> I love that. Even wearing that with a colorful bag as well. Let me show you what I'm thinking about here from my bag collection something like this this is so cool right i just love to play on the colors and sometimes adding more colors which is so so fun um, for the season so i'm definitely keeping that i love that yes uh, what have we here oh this is a thrifted dress i don't know if it's vintage or not but i love the shape of dresses um this is a long this is a maxi dress let me see 
yeah it's a maxi dress i actually love this kind of dresses and it's crazy how i forgot i had that there's no brand name um i think it got removed but look how flowy it is i just love the delicate um neckline with the pleats here and i love those um sleeves look at that it's flared and very feminine and of course with the straps for me i like to cinch in my waist and wear it on the side make a cute bow i think it's really cute or sometimes i'll even go as far as cutting the straps here cutting them off and then adding my own belt or wear it by itself so it's nice i love wearing um black dresses with like big bold florals i recently showed on my community page a dress i wore this week actually um, when I went to do that presentation um, for Goodwill for the class and I wore kind of like a similar dress because the dress itself is black then you add all of the florals and uh, splashed onto it and I just love these vibes <laughs> when you love something what did I say what did I say I purchased both at different times Lord have mercy. Okay, I feel like one of them has got to go. Honestly, so this is vintage. We're going this Christy Michaels. I feel like we need a comparison here. I feel like this one is very nice. I like the style of it. I love the cape kind of like top attached to it. And it's got, you know, the straps as well at the back. <sighs> you see how sheer it is? You can see it. So this is no problem. You wear like a black slip underneath it and you're done. You're good to go. This one can go. It's probably, it's shorter. What do you think? Am I pulled into it like that? This is a brand Christy Michaels. Like this can go. I will not miss this one. So I'm definitely keeping that. Yes. Beautiful. Next up, we have another dress. Oh, yeah. I remember that. Casual Corner Vintage. I love those... Um, polyester viscose dresses and uh, that shape is very cute and feminine and flattering but i feel like this is more of my mom's i don't know right now in my for my taste right now i feel like it's not really it's not really appealing to me like that but i love it to tears the hem looking really nice you see what i'm talking about black background with florals colorful floors i just love it i just love it kind of similar to the other one too okay this one can go too oh already purging two dresses okay okay next up uh, you see black <laughs> black dress with um colorful florals oh my gosh i've been ready for spring my whole life it seems like oh let me talk about prints clashing or wearing prints on prints this will look so so good i love that this animal prints with the green tones and then the green florals yes I'm thinking this one can go to I love when it's got pockets oh yes this is such a cute feminine dress I feel like dancing it's so cute and feminine you add like a cute belt uh, with a shoulder pad this is so great yeah yes 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 this can go as well ah uh, next step a vintage dress oh i love this dress are you kidding me um sherry martin size 14. Oh, i love the flow of it when i talk about the movement you see how elegant it is and this with some 
espadrilles for the summer with some tennis shoes with some mules and with some boots you can definitely edge it up and also dress it down so even with some combat boots i love adding that feminine and that kind of like tough masculine touch like adding a military vibe i think this is so cool i'm definitely keeping this dress fabulous i love it next up oh i forgot about this dress really huh this is thrifted but that was from the fast fashion brand it says miss look size XL I just love the colorway for sure when I saw it I just love kind of like the 70s kind of like shirt top you know the top part of it and it was very light and uh, very you know roomy and I just love um, very boho very reminiscent of the 60s almost like psychedelic when you look at the prints which I loved about it and it's actually got two slits Hmm, on the side and I just love that ruffle hem as well this is a dress I see myself wearing right now with a pants I'm wearing even like you know um, some flowy satiny pants underneath it because I think the slit is kind of high a little bit yeah it gets to my thigh so definitely wearing something underneath it I think it's such a fun dress for this summer what do you think I love it I just love it kind of like the a line kind of shape to it yes I like it yes this is something I can wear you know you're going to a terrace you know to have some brunch you are going sightseeing yes this is very cool like a casual number like this Ooh. okay okay did I ever wear this? No, apparently I did not because the tag's still on. I bought this from Ross, as you can see. And I had actually bought a similar dress from Ross, which I think I finally gave my mom. I just love flowy dresses and this is so feminine. I just loved the billowy sleeves and the shape of it. You know, the crisscross cleavage is cute. But am I going to wear it right now? I don't think so. I really don't. So it's got to go. It's cute though. Such a cute, cute dress. But I don't think I'm going to wear it. No. It's not me right now. So it's just taking up space for nothing. Because as we know, things are still coming in. <laughs> the way I love thrifting. So for this one, oh, I love me a good like um, long vest situation. I love my waistcoat, my um, vest and stuff like that to wear over it. I love layering. So this is definitely a nice number. I love that deep chocolate. Harold Powell, this is vintage and this is not going anywhere. I think I worked on it. I think it's got sleeves in the past that I removed or something, but I love it. I love it. You can throw it on anything and you are good to go. For example, I have this dress from Zara. You wear this underneath it. You know, it adds like a different layer. It makes it look more like smart. Um, very more like elevated, I would say. And then you're good to go. Bam. You see what I mean? This is a necessity in my wardrobe. These pieces. Oh my gosh. And I completely forgot about that. Okay. I made an outfit right here right now so because the thing with me I'm always trying to elevate any piece I have it's kind of rare for me to be wearing just one thing the way it was sold <laughs> I'm like okay what else can I do how can I play with it to make it you know more Doris so this is definitely staying are you serious yes it's staying the next number is this dress that I bought. Oh, I love this color combo, sis. This is cool for this season, of course. For my taste, I wear like a bodysuit, like a black bodysuit. It could be like a white bodysuit, anything you want. Or oh, a t-shirt, very cute as well. Um, 
on the Nefet. This is by Target, the collaboration with um, Tabitha Brown, which was, what, three years ago? And I actually have another, another color of the same collection for the same style. It's like a pink and the red at the hem, I remember. So I'm definitely keeping this. I really, really like this dress. This is so cool. I literally see myself also wearing it in, more, in a more like professional, more business-like way with a blazer. Yes. Oh, and I love it with some white trainers, as the British will say, some white tennis shoes, for example. And the thing is, there's a cutout here. You see at the bra part, there's like this bow and there's a cutout. I want to stay modest. This doesn't determine, this does not deter me from buying a dress like this because since I layer it, I like it. I like it. It's a real good cotton and it's got pockets. I mean, come on. I just love also the elasticated um, back to it. Very like, you know, it's giving more stretch, which is always good. And this is some combat boots, sis. Some boots. And I love my platform boots. So, you know, you can definitely edge it up so well. Or you can also wear a white button down shirt. Talk about making it look more like elevated and preppy at the same time. You look so preppy chic. I love, love that. So I'm definitely keeping this dress for sure. I kept the other one as well. Now, oh my gosh, I love, love these prints. My goodness, thrift advantage. Let me just take this in. Take the whole thing in, sis. This vintage dress is fabulous. It's like a midi dress for me. Let me see. Yeah, it's a midi dress for me. But I always like to add like, um, you know, it have a layer underneath it. So I can wear like a wide leg trousers, um, black underneath it to make it, you know, more bam, like I like to make it. And I think it looks so good. With a dress like this, with bold prints like that, you don't have to do too much with accessories. I feel like a nice pair of earrings and I am good to go. Or if I choose so, I can even add like a hat like this with this look, with some sunglasses. You're just killing the game. There's nothing else to say. Who else is going to have this? If you go to like any party, any gathering, any anywhere, sis. And you can actually wear this to work too. Like if you don't have a too formal like um, work environment, you can still wear that too. It's covered up. It's very professional. Very like um, you're giving ethnic secretarial vibes. <laughs> <laughs> which I love. I feel like, you know, it's you, but you know, I'm still covered up. I'm professional. I am. I just mind my own business, you know. I stand on business. <laughs> so I love this. I'm definitely keeping this dress. Oh, yeah. Yes, yes, yes. I forgot about this. This is actually... I've bought it at Walmart, I believe, like on the clearance rack for like um, $5, oh my gosh, like three or four years ago, as I started this channel, actually. And you know me and animal print, it's a love story. I don't have to reiterate that ever again, because <laughs> you can tell I always buy it when I see it and I like that. Um, so the brand is Studio A, size L. And I just love this dress. This is so versatile. Like those baby doll dresses, you see, kiss on points. I'm telling you, I'm not much of a body count dresser. Like um, I love more like flowy or just not too tight on me, roomy, which I love. And this is so, so cute. And um, I actually did a styling video on this channel, like a reel on how to style such a dress. I'll insert the... Um, the short for you but i think this is so cute i love wearing this with um, some wide leg pants some linen pants um you can wear a skirt underneath it you can wear some jeans you can wear it by itself i mean this is so cute i'm definitely keeping this and i also do real as well so you can see what i mean
next step yep we have another <laughs> another animal point number oh my lord this is um the point is beach lounge lounge collection made in india all of the fabrics made in india oh my gosh such a nice nice quality and i wore it a few times you know for me there's a cutout in the back but i wear my bodysuit and i'm good to go and uh, usually i'll wear like a blazer over something like this but is it calling my name right now that's the question so i am wondering I feel like I don't feel really drawn to it right now it's cute it's cute I love the back with the buttons it's cute but this is maybe a maybe which I'm going to set aside to try on later and make up my mind about it so this is a maybe so when you actually trying to purge or kind of revisit your clothes you can have a to go pile um, a purging pile and also like a maybe where you need to try on those pieces see how you feel because you know we change um, maybe you see that it still fits it's flattering and whatnot so I'll try on this dress later and see if I still like it if not it, it's it's going it's going so um, yeah let's move on to the next one. Oh, I remember this dress Ooh. I just love the asymmetrical can you check out the asymmetrical like hemline going on and also the difference of um, style I love the pleated side over there and this you know the normal side on this this is cute but I think I'm seeing some kind of like oil stain or something whatever it is this is cute I thrifted it actually by Topshop size 10 I thrifted it Topshop I wore this I believe with some boots oh I like it I like it still I like it this is so on point you see how like um, pleated skirts pleated dresses are trendy right now and I bought this like four years ago I thrifted it so it goes to show you sometimes you don't necessarily have to purge 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 you haven't worn it in a year you may fall back in love again this is so cute I just love the details and uh, I think I'm going to keep it this is so cute I just need to fix I think there's some oily stains I'm not sure what's what's up with that I'll just have to fix it Hmm. and then I'll decide but I'm definitely keeping this oh my gosh with some knee high boots with some knee high boots is beautiful okay what do we have here next up <gasps> yes I never wore it oh my gosh Nanette Lepore 999 goodwill and this is such a cute dress you see me how i love the um double tier kind of hems the ruffling you see the um recurring theme here with my dresses and the floors i love me a nice floor and this dress is beautiful it's double breasted <laughs> it's so cute oh, i just love that v crossing here and uh, i love the shape of it this is so flattering do you see how they actually uh, made space for the hips which gives way such a nice silhouette and uh, oh i love this dress i will put it on my roster <laughs> to wear it one of these days for church and whatnot this is so cute and let me see how long it is yes oh it's so cute so flirty next up we have this dress i believe i bought from target this is a one strap kind of situation like i told you i would wear something underneath it and i'm good to go and i just like that iridescent kind of from green color almost like shiny like that greenish brown color i really like it but i feel like it's not it's it, it's not giving right now I don't feel it's giving right now no but I don't think it's giving 
It's, it can go. It's got to go. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, I don't know. I don't. I don't feel drawn to it. Next step. What do we have here? <gasps> we have this delicate. Kind of like organza fabric dress. This is vintage Christy Lee by um, Plaza South, size 8. I think it's on its course. I wore it a few times, I believe. I feel like it's on its course. It can go. It can go. This is so cute, of course, with a slip dress underneath it, like I said. Oh, this is so cute. I just love the waistline. Oh, so cute, so cute. And the buttons at the um, sleeve. So cute, but it's okay. It's got to go. Next step. I remember this dress. I, I used to wear that a lot. And me and polka dots. I love me some good polka dots. This is like that orangey bright color. And this is by Shein. Did I thrift it or did I buy it? Maybe I bought it four or five years ago. And I have a similar one actually by Shein as well. Do you see what I mean? When you like something, you like it. <laughs> This is beautiful. I just love the polka dot. The sleeves are long. I just love that good ruffle like mock neck situation. And uh, it's so feminine. This with some pumps, with some wedges. So cute. Oh, I'm going to keep that. So cute. I oh, this is some like some snake prints that I thrifted. Oh my gosh, years ago. And uh, Salvation Army. Because I remember the tag, $10, probably $5 that day. Because they have a lot of like 50% um, off um, discounts, like routinely, often. And uh, with some pockets on the side. Right now, off the bat, I feel like, yes, I like it. Off the bat. So this is one of those dresses I'm going to try on again. But right now I'm like, yes, this is this is fire. This is gorgeous. I love it. I'll say one thing that sometimes I hate about the folded um, sleeves like this. You see how it's kind of like falling and it looks kind of like unkempt. I hate that. So maybe I'm going to sew. If I decide to keep it, I'll just put a few like stitches here very delicate this way it won't look you know that's why i don't buy shirts like that with folded hems like that calf situation so i'll i'll check on that later maybe if i yeah if i you know a few stitches around just like a few inches away from each other that'll help it to stay put but this is a cute dress i really see myself in it so i'm going to keep that okay next up i remember that i wore this to the ground and i was like okay go get some rest i'm going to focus on other dresses now <laughs> i told you i love my plants this is so cute oh i love this dress i wonder i think it still fits me doesn't it when was the last time i actually wore it like two years ago or something i love it i love the brown i love the different colors the blue and the brown and i just love this neckline beautiful so just to make sure it fits me right i'm going to try this on i told you more florals more florals it really reminds me of um this dress you see what i mean <laughs> I love this style. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. So, this is nice, but I can tell you I don't need it right now. Christy Michaels. I think it's time for it to go. I wore it a few times back in the day, and I think it's been a long time since I wore this. Let me see how snug you fit right now. I gain a few pounds. I know that. <laughs> so, I haven't been active since 
August last year after I had my wreck because if you can't walk you can you know it's hard to work out or just be active on your feet so I intend to lose a few pounds I'm working on it right now but this is not something that I need to keep in my wardrobe oh I love seeing all this space look at that <laughs> next up Oh, this rampage dress. Oh my gosh. I wore it so much. I remember. It's such a cute dress. Look at the prints. I love this style for real. This is so feminine and cute. Size, size 11. It's so right to find size 11. This is so weird. It's so funny. Size 11. So it's not a 12. It's not a 10. It's an 11. Okay. Um this honestly i don't know if it'll still fit me i have to be honest because this is not really gi giving any stretch at all either it fits you or not but the good thing about it sis you know if you have a dress like that with the buttons all the way down you can wear it as a duster which i love to do so this is a style hack you see what i mean right when i'm talking about the duster you wear it open on like a bodycon dress let me show you on a bodycon dress like this and then you can still wear it you know to have that flowy element to it you can wear this with um over a shirt and uh, some jeans over a satin dress you see what i mean so um this is actually versatile if you have a dress like that that you want to wear different ways sis, don't hesitate do not hesitate to open it and wear it as a duster so yeah i think this one is going to next step oh my gosh i never wore this for real me and points between my floral prints my ethnic prints <laughs> this is by goodwill 5.99 tag still on and i just love that elasticated waist i just love it because it's very flattering if you don't have like a defined waist for example um the elastics actually sit right underneath your breast that's where you know you have the smallest area of your body the smallest part of your waist I, I, I should say then it kind of flows I feel like it's very flattering for all um, shapes I feel like because you know it gives you that feminine shape whether you an apple or an inverted triangle I feel like it gives you volume at the same time as well at the bottom and it kind of like skims your body which I love so this is why I'm attracted to it because it's flattering of course to your chest and then it snatches you and then it just flows i still want to wear this the spring has sprung and i feel like this is a nice dress yes i love it it's so soft and does it have pockets oh, that's the only thing but it's okay next up we have this dress oh so good by tabet size 12 that i thrifted oh, prints galore i'm telling you so right now i think i will rather try it as a duster like i said it's not going to fit completely but i feel like i can dispose of this one yeah it's okay talbot is such a nice brand we have this I used to wear this to the ground seriously this has carried me through a few pregnancies even <gasps> love that love love that you see what I mean about those kind of like empire waist dresses and like wrap dresses how flattering they are but I wonder if it still fits me size 8 I have to be honest I feel like this is JG hook is a brand linen this is so so good but I feel like I wore this so much over the years that it's okay it's good Lord the cost per wear for this dress has definitely been fulfilled and exceeded at this point so it can go this actually but recently when I tell you about my love for like anything cultural and uh, I just love that so this is I think Indian 
and uh, I thrifted it, which I love the two slits. Oh, it's so beautiful with um, the zipper on the side. I just love the delicacy. Look at the buttons. Oh, I love that. I'm definitely keeping this for sure. Next up, we have a more modern dress. This is by Zara and I wore this here recently. I bought it, was it last year? Yes, last year. And this is so cute. It really gives me such a nice like preppy and uh, smart, I don't know. I love this look, very corporate at the same time while being feminine. And I love the contrast with the black buttons and the um, pockets on the side, like a bustier kind of thing. I wore this on this channel, I believe with a button down black shirt with a tie and I just loved it and next time I can actually wear it with a black blazer for example for a nice black and red look gorgeous so I'm definitely keeping this dress definitely And uh, we have this dress, which I recently spotted in a reel here. I style it. I've had it for a long time. Sometimes when I'm batch um, content creating, for example, I'll set a few things that pick my interest and then I'll just style it outside just for reels. They don't have to go necessarily with a video I'm filming. And I saw it, I was like, you know what? It's going to be the spring. What if I show how to style this dress? And I love it. This dress by itself could be like, in one video just one video the subject of a video i thrifted it this was by target a collab with rick so the designer this is size 14 and when i thrifted it i just love the prints to begin with you know me with a black background and uh, the colorful um flowers which i love so let me kind of get closer there's a mark neck situation here. Then you get to the waist. There's like a gathered kind of waist here with some ruching. Then you get to here. There's this like um, ruffle going on. So it's asymmetrical. It's a high and low situation. So if I spread it, you can tell. Then you turn um, at the back. There's that open back. And there's a little bit of elastic here at the back as well. And I mean, some washing here at the sleeves. I mean, this is a gorgeous, gorgeous dress. I just could not resist. This is an example of, you can still be modest and still wear things with cut out, with open backs and whatnot. For me, I feel like this is the epitome of knowing how to layer. <laughs> because you gotta know how to plug in your pieces for it to look harmonious right so i just love this dress and i styled it with a ruffled skirt that this is the skirt i paired it with so you see how this um the ruffles actually peak from underneath it so you don't see my leg you see how you can see the tool skirt from underneath it I think it's so cute it adds such a different dimension to the dress it really elevates it also in a fun way and the black color kind of blends seamlessly with the black of a, skirt, of a dress as well and then at the back I'm just wearing a sleeveless um, shirt that's what you see from the back um, in that styling. This is how I started simply and of course I wanted to add some more prints of course. The more the better. This is how I roll and for the prints I added some um, animal prints belly flats by Zara that I bought on sale maybe last year or two years ago and this is this leather is beautiful and I was like oh animal prints with these prints loving the whole combo and then of course I added a lot of like gold accent jewelry as in like my big bold rings and my earrings and spotted my afro and voila so I love this dress it's not going anywhere are you serious are you serious right now come on Before I 
continue sis have you subscribed to my channel like i know you're enjoying the vibe and the fashion and the banter and whatnot come on now you know we have got a vibe please subscribe now and let's continue thank you for doing so next up <laughs> this is the kind of dress that will make you scream at least it does for me for sure for sure if you are not new to my channel you've been here maybe two years now i thrifted this beautiful dress thrifted it yes and i thrifted it at goodwill the halloween section on the rack every year i feel like every year god is like i'm sending you a very unique piece this year daughter go and get it go and get it i was like they think this is halloweeny are you serious right now this is what a costume give me a break this dress is just spectacular oh my gosh and this is actually by a brand i think they're based in west africa this is studio 189 and sis let me tell you i looked up the brand they actually have a website they actually sell with nordstrom and I still see a lot of the cute dresses, they love it, tie-dye, the indigo um, prints, and they are just great at it. I think they're based in Ghana, I think, Ghana, West Africa. So this is beautiful. I love it. This is so long. This is so long. So I always wear a pair of platform shoes with it, platform boots, platform a uh, Mary Jane, something like that, because it's so long. I am five seven, five seven and a half ish. So this is very long. But sis, I love the drama of this dress. This is beautiful, perfection, and oh, it's so grand. This dress is so grand. Look at the sleeves. Look at the long sleeves. Look at the large calf. Look at that. And it fits me perfectly. That was size size L. Yeah, handmade in Ghana, 100% cotton. Oh my gosh! I was like Halloween. What? <laughs> so glad when I saw it. So I looked it up, and at Nordstrom, they're selling for one of the dresses. The dresses are selling for like eight hundred dollars or something like that. So that was a bargain. That was a huge bargain. I love it. This color, the print, nothing else to say about it. Nothing else. Next up, we have this. Oh, I like this long, like, um, transparent sheer shirt. Oh, the roses are beautiful. And I don't think I ever wore it. I see Steve a tag on it, right? The, oh my gosh, this was brand new with an extra button and whatnot. The brand is Calvin Klein, size 1X. When I tell you, I shopped in every size section. This Because this is gorgeous. I love how flow it is. You can literally use it just like as a shirt right now. It's a midi dress, pretty much. And you can wear it as a shirt. You can wear some jeans underneath it. You can add it over a cute... Um, sleeveless dress for example and it's very romantic very flowy and cute I love that oh so gorgeous so gorgeous and the thing is you can also wear it on button on button like that and I love that as a duster you wear it over something cute and it looks so chic I love that so I'm definitely keeping this and I'm going to make it a point to wear it soon. And with a wide leg pants, even with a pink. With some red trousers over his nice skirt. You can belt it. You can tuck it in. So many options. This is so cool. Even as a cover up for a swimsuit, for example, you're going to the beach, you want to cover up and still look cute. I love that. You want to go for date night even. This is very easy breezy. It really gives me like a vacation vibe, if you see what I mean. So I'm definitely keeping that. Calvin Klein, you bet. 
Next up, we have this dress that I definitely thrifted, I can remember, by Shein. And remember when I was talking to you about the gathered waist here, making it very flattering. Hmm. I feel like it's, mm, it's not my vibe right now. I literally remember when I bought it though. It was on this channel. I hold it. So I'm going to insert the clip. Yeah. Okay. You know what? This is something I can wear running errands though. I love wearing my dresses like this when I'm running errands. I just put my slides on, my tennis shoes, and I'm going to a post office to Walmart and whatnot. So this will be a... Let me try it and then decide after. Next up. Oh, we have this dress by Zara that I bought on sale for maybe like $15 a long time ago. And it's like a flowy dress. I really liked the colorway, the red color, the red and black. And then you can see some beads that have been sewn into it. So they add that nice detail element throughout the whole dress and like some shine as well. Size XXL. I will try this on. I need to see how I feel in it. Right now I cannot really tell, but I feel like I need to try this on. Maybe add like a black belt to it and kind of try to judge it up and then I will decide. So I have about three, six dresses that I'm going to try on later. Oh, this is an Avashian number that I thrifted. Oh, I love that. Love, love that. I love it. Checkers print so much. And uh, the hound's tooth and whatnot. So this is beautiful. I can tell. I love it. With a bold red belt or some red boots. You know me. I'm all into the extremes. <laughs> Let me show you. I don't know. I feel like this can really pop. I love that. This also can be very elevated. It's such a fun spring summer dress, honestly. With some boots, some tennis shoes, with some pumps. Yes, beautiful, keeping that. Next up, we have this dress by Zara. Why do I even keep it here? I actually have a smaller closet in my bedroom where I keep things I wear like on the go to just get out of a house and I feel like this belongs to that category I actually used to wear that so much oh my gosh and I just love it it's flowy just easy breezy and this I'm going to wear upstairs when I'm running errands there you go because dresses are so easy if you're looking for pieces to wear on the fly, you know, as a busy person, as a busy mom and whatnot, I feel like with a dress, it's just one piece and you're done. You're ready to go, to go out the door. Um, when I'm trying to put on like a, a skirt and a top, <laughs> it has to go together. Do the colors kind of go together? The style, does, do I look? I don't know. Dresses are so much easier. On a daily basis, I wear my maxi dresses, my midi dresses, and I'm out the door with some ballet flats, some mules, some um, tennis shoes. That's how you see me in town because two pieces to put together, sometimes you don't, just don't have the um, mental bandwidth to deal with. Oh, this is another Walmart. Remember the Walmart dresses, like shirt dresses I actually showed you in the previous um, videos? I actually have the black version of this. I have the blue version. I have several versions of that. This I got on sale years ago by Walmart. And of course, this one was here and I did not see it time and through. Time and through. $13.98 and yes I'm going to keep it upstairs I love those dresses it's got pockets and you can wear anything over it like you can add a sweater you can add a a cardigan you can wear so many different things with it you can add your jeans if it's cold outside or some leggings some 
combat boots or just some cute booties i mean this is so cute easy breezy you go on a i don't know family reunion kind of thing you're going to the park you are just going to have some lunch some breakfast i think this is so cute with some white tennis shoes you look so coordinated and cute i love that so i'm going to wear this upstairs so i can just wear it around town real quickly and i am good to go oh uh, we have a sweater here situation okay so sweaters belong to the sweaters so I'm not going to touch on that right now. Next up, ooh, we have a jumpsuit. I used to wear that. Oh my gosh, I forgot about it. I actually wore that here on this channel before. This is by No Boundaries, which is a Walmart brand, XL 15 to 17. And I'm not into like jumpsuits like that because I feel like it makes me more top heavy um, but this one was so cute and when I wore this on this channel I added like a duster over it so you know you can still layer your jumpsuit sis yes you can and I like the finished result I'm definitely keeping this <music> which I thrifted and never wore it must go it must go it's so cute it really gave me like mod vintage of course polka dots and me you know already what it is somebody else will be able to enjoy it it's okay it's gotta go but I just love the blend between the white and the green this is such a cute cute dress okay you a goner next up which i never wore i thrifted it oh i actually bought quite a few denim like flowy dresses that goodwill one time it's like the owner just or maybe the um the company just sent a lot of inventories at goodwill the brand is zenzia i think it's a fast fashion brand Zenzia and uh, this one was $7.99 I think it was half price of that day and I have a long sleeve one and this one I don't know why I never wore this one but I'm fully sure this is still right up my alley I am fully sure of it with a dress like this is think about even adding a trench coat um, when it's still cooler outside look at something like this you add a, a cool trend coat on over it to elevate it so you see you see what i mean why the waist like it's not just a simple dress anymore because you elevate it with a trench coat or you can think about a jacket for example you can think about a denim shirt denim on denim to play on the um canadian tuxedo um style and still look edgy think about adding a button down shirt underneath it you see how you can spice up things so i'm definitely keeping this and the thing is i love to belt such dresses it's definitely going to be handy i have so many blazers or oh, add a kimono sis add a kimono this is a thrifted kimono and i'm thinking you see how the blue kind of mesh so well together I don't know what else to say i just don't <laughs> i just don't say this fashion is about you know taking risks playing with your pieces girl it's such a plain dress well this can be elevated i'm thinking about a stack of pearl necklaces i'm thinking about a bold like um bold custom necklace so many different ways so i'm definitely keeping this oh that's the dress i was talking about remember when i said um i bought a bunch the same day so this is a lighter denim fabric fabric um a, a lighter denim color this is very much giving me like the house on the prairie like sister wife situation <laughs> and i like it because i never wear it the way it is 
and uh, before you know it you're like oh i like your dress and it's just a simple dress so this is triple xl crazy but i love it like i said try on everything you like because sometimes sizes kind of change from one point to another and uh, i think yes this is a keeper this this is my typical get out of a house no fuss you dressed you're looking nice with your nice shoes your nice whatever you done i thrifted this and this is by um nora cora which is a fast fashion brand i believe and let me tell you sis i love love this dress so much i love the colorway so me i love how it you know it kind of snatches me at the bust it snag at the bust and then it flows out very cool what do we have here oh yes yes i remember this dress yes i thrifted it there's no tag to see the brand but sis isn't this dress gorgeous gorgeous period like that's it that's it with a very eclectic bag like this you know me <laughs> i thrifted this and it's gorgeous yes or with something da, 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 let me see something a bit more formal gorgeous <sighs> the blue of this dress first of all it's a gorgeous maxi dress i love the shape of it i love the um the motif it's like a big butterfly so stand out you will stand out sis it's such a great great dress when i wear this stopping traffic stopping traffic who said because you're wearing covered up you cannot stop traffic yes you can trust me <laughs> We have this um, yellow, kind of like half thin dress that I thrifted years ago. And uh, I still like it. I still like it. I like the vivid yellow. And this is something very easy. I can wear this summer for sure. I like it. It's so me. It's so different. Yes. So I think they are more like caftans and abayas and kimonos and whatnot so we will stop after this dress because then in an upcoming video i am going to go through this part of iraq oh, let me talk about this right now since i know it's staying anyways i bought it from zara and it was on sale it's like a linen blend material and uh, size xxl and i like it this blue is cute i'm keeping it i know i'm keeping it anyway so done and this is a nice like abaya um, maxi dress by Shein. i believe i thrifted it this is 4xl but it fits me perfectly remember how i said like with um, plain solid color dresses like this you can wear so many things with it because i love wearing my caftans with it what i mean by caftan something like this as an example my caftan abaya so yes i love it with my big old scarf i think we're gonna stop for now okay sis i hope you have enjoyed this video and i just enjoyed revisiting all of my dresses and my looks and it really reminds me when i need to get out like what i can wear because if you don't go through it you forget what you have right so i hope you have considered joining this family and subscribing to my channel please subscribe like share leave a comment and i will see you soon i believe there is a collective thrift haul that is overdue and there's our haul and a an h m what else h m um alice and olivia kind of like all those like other stores oh my gosh so 
<laughs> but it's a good thing we have so much content coming soon i'm very excited about it i hope that you come back and see you soon bye stay blessed